I am really into extreme collectibles. Me, not so much. Eh, I don't know if I like that. That's what I said. Hey guys, welcome to the Extreme Channel. We are the X's. <laughs> I don't know about <laughs> I'm Mr. X. And I'm Mrs. X. And if you're new to the channel, we are all about extreme collectibles. And when I say we, I mean I am. Me, not so much. You can't say the same thing you said in the <laughs> intro. But if you followed the channel recently, you know that Mrs. X has come on and started expressing her opinion about my collecting style. So today we're bringing a few special things to you. Number one, Mrs. X is going to run the show. Awesome. Number two is we're going to do another top 10 countdown list. It's kind of been a staple part of this channel for the last year or so. We count down top 10 of whatever. Sometimes we do sexual positions. Sometimes we do high-end statues. Sometimes we do certain... Uh... Certain what? Am I going to have to sleep on the couch again? However, before we get started in this top 10 countdown, go ahead and check this out. We are going to hit 20,000 subscribers in 2020. To do that, we're giving away a statue every 2,500 subs. At 15,000 subs, the winner will get to choose between these two PCS Mortal Kombat statues. Make sure that you've liked this video, you've subscribed to the channel, and you've hit that bell notification. Then stay tuned towards the end of this video to find out how to enter. So I randomly came up with my list of the top 10 things I hate about Mr. X collecting. So, That's the first time you've ever called me Mr. X. Do you not want me to call you Mr. I kind of like it. <laughs> so we'll start at the bottom, number 10, and work our way up to the number one reason I don't like him collecting. So number you 10... You seem really awkward today. Loosen up. I don't like running the show. <laughs> That's what I said. <laughs> That's what she says. <laughs> Are we ready for number 10 or not? I'm just sitting here. Okay, number 10. The kids won't go to the basement by themselves. Okay, so that's a pretty good one. Yeah, there's scary crap everywhere. But that could also be listed as a positive thing. Maybe I don't want them down here. So every time they want need to come down here for something, why, I why, have to join them? Why would they need to come down here? Uh, sodas in the refrigerator. Don't we have a refrigerator upstairs? Yeah, I'm not keeping their soda in my refrigerator. <laughs> so we actually have three refrigerators and four freezers. And I know you're thinking, that's a lot of freezers. What do you keep in there? Body Nothing. parts. <laughs> Actually, I think they are almost empty. Okay, so solid number 10. Cool. Whatever. Number nine. The dirty boxes sitting on the carpet and the floor. I know, I'm trying to come up with a retort to the dirty boxes. Uh, you don't have one. Uh, have you? Didn't I buy you a vacuum cleaner that's a, yeah. like a robot and he does it by himself? Well, you did, but... It doesn't get rid of all the nasty crap from shipping. How do you know? I can use a towel and wipe it and it's still there. Do you have like a black light? I hope I don't. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I really don't like not running the show. This is kind of bothering me. Mm -hmm. But uh, so I think that's fair, but for the most part, we don't keep the boxes here. No, I'm talking about when they come in my house. Your house? Yeah. Is your name on the title? Yep. It's just not on the loan. It's just Correct. just my name on the loan, yep. but her name and my name is on the title. That's a slick deal. Yep. All right, number eight. Okay, so number eight, I chose messy basement. Okay. From the boxes. That's the same as number nine. Eh, no, it's not. Because number nine was the boxes sitting on the floor. And number eight is a messy basement from all the styrofoam from unpacking, it gets all over the place. How many times have you had On to vacuum? On your clothes. How many times have you had to vacuum this basement? So there was a rule when you started collecting that I don't clean anything down here. Sometimes that styrofoam is unpacked upstairs that I have to clean up. You know, this video is really going to make one of us sleep on the couch. <laughs> and it's not going to be me. It's not going to be me. Number six. Are you ready for it? I thought we were number eight. That, no. Oh, seven, sorry. We're at seven, sorry. Okay, taking the heavy boxes to UPS. So that is something I will give you. 
Whenever I sell stuff, we actually have a for sale video coming, and we have three of them, actually, I need you to take tomorrow. Oh, of course. So uh, she takes all those to UPS during the week, which I really I, appreciate. I have to. Well, we could schedule them to uh, pick it up, but since they don't have to drop stuff off when it's Correct. scheduled, that wouldn't yeah. go well. But think of how strong you're getting. I don't need to get any stronger. If if I ever mutated into like a werewolf or something, yeah. you could take me on. Oh. Not much of a consolation, is it? No. All right. Okay. Number six. The space. And I when I say space, I mean just the boxes. All the space it takes up. It takes up space in my storage area. Not that I have anything to put in there, but just generally all the boxes. How many boxes are in the storage area right now? 50. There's like five. There's probably five or six. Really? Yes. Oh, there was 50 last time I looked. That was like three months ago. Yeah. Still, I don't like the boxes. <laughs> so, Anywho. right now, the garage has a bunch right oh, now. Oh, the garage does well, have a lot. Well, that's because we're transitioning the ones we're going to sell. I know. All right, so I think that one is totally not valid. Okay, boxes. Move on. So the boxes have now been three of your Correct. top five. Correct. So you like the statues, you just don't like the oh, boxes. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> They're coming along. Okay. Those are on my bottom of my list, remember? You mean, which is the top? I guess. So, um, then the next one is the actual... Why do you keep looking down there? Because that's where my phone is. That's oh, my list. Gotcha. Do you want me to put it up here so everybody can see my list? Well, I don't think they'll be able to see it. Okay. I can set it up here. I mean, whatever. Uh, so the next one is the actual space the statues take. They have taken over the basement. So I... Everywhere. I, I can't... Your office at work. I can't disagree. It's upstairs. I mean, there's stuff upstairs. There's one. There's one. Yeah. I don't like it up there. Okay. So <laughs> we have a tr uh, three level home and I have one level. She gets two levels. True. I don't get them. I mean, everybody gets them. Is any of my stuff in those levels? Yeah, a lot like of your what? stuff. Name one thing. Uh, your clothes. My clothes? Okay, <laughs> we can get rid of those. I have no problem. Uh, how about all that stuff on the wall in your TV room? Okay, the sports... That's my room, though. I, so I, I have one floor oh. and one room. <laughs> and one you don't room. use the kitchen at all, I'm sure. I, unless you're out of town. Oh. And then I go in there to call to go. There's a phone in the kitchen? <laughs> <laughs> so uh, I don't understand because, yes, it takes up the whole basement, but you have the rest of the house. And w So what if it takes up room in my office? Well, I thought we finished the basement for a place that we could hang out. <laughs> I fooled you pretty good, didn't Yeah. Should have kept that money. You ready for the next? Let's go. You're running the show. I know. Uh, the time you spend searching for the statues that you're going to buy. Please elaborate. It's a lot of time. Please elaborate. Like, do I, am I like on a detective and I go out and, you know, no, you on quests? No, you're on the internet all the time, dude. I'm on looking, the internet? Looking for... How many times do you have to recharge your phone for that game you play? I don't play that anymore. <laughs> okay, how many times did you? Not very often. Hey, I left my tablet at the office Friday night. I know, and you're still shaking about it. It's Sunday, and look how look how calm I am. Yeah. It's no problem. It's no problem. I know. And also, I want to I wanna point out that when we talk about these statues and the movies that some of them are from, you have no idea what the movie is because you were on your device the entire time during uh, the movie. But it's not a movie I want to watch. So if I'm not searching for that, what would you like to do instead? Searching for statues? Yeah, you, you say it takes up too much time. I say it takes up a lot of time. I didn't say too much. I said a lot. So it's a, it shouldn't be a complaint if it's not too much. But I You made me come up with ten things. You could only come up with five. I watched your video. Which video? <laughs> ten things that I hate about why I hate it. I got started into collecting. Well, I'm not going to have a lot you of things. You only chose... Five, and you said your video said the ten things I hate about we're, collecting, we're, and you chose five positives and five negatives. So, How could that be a video about ten things you don't like about collecting? So, <laughs> I love collecting, so it's difficult to come up with things I oh, hate about it. Gotcha. If that makes but sense. But you made me come up with ten, and I didn't even have ten. So I gotta ask you: Is this a list of what you hate about collecting, or what you hate about me? <laughs> collecting. Okay. I love you. Thank you. Yeah. We should do a list of 10 things you hate about me. <laughs> Let's not. <laughs> <laughs> she just tells me, so. Might as well, right? It's true. Number three. 
expensive display cases. Okay, so let me let let's use this as an example okay. right behind us. Sure. This display case right yeah. here costs around three hundred dollars. Just okay. this one. Yeah, one. So one. one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, forty, fifty, sixty. <laughs> so listen. <laughs> There are, how many statues in here? One, two, three, four, five, six statues in here. That specific one? Yes. Because those are small. But listen, so there's six statues in here. Okay. And those statues range anywhere from $500 to $1,500. Okay. So we'll say an average of $750 each. Okay. Fair enough? Okay. So we have $4,500 worth of statues in this one case. Okay. And I spent $300, which is less than 10%, to make it... Uh, display proudly, protect it from dust, and make it pretty. So it's less. So you don't want dust on it because you don't want to clean the dust off. Oh yeah. So <laughs> that is less than ten percent of the price of the statues to make it look pretty. 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 You're worried about pretty. Manly. <laughs> I don't know any other adjectives to make it look good. So I don't think that's a valid complaint. But if we didn't have the statues, then I wouldn't have spent the money on the displays. Well, duh. <laughs> I'm just Empty saying. Empty displays would look pretty stupid. Uh, Number two. The time you spend putting them together and reviewing them on YouTube. So the time that YouTube takes. Yeah, I mean. If I didn't have YouTube, what would we be doing together? I mean, I don't know. I mean, you spend like 90 hours a week down here. <laughs> so, what would we do together for those 90 hours? Uh, we could watch a lot of TV. <laughs> <laughs> the Bachelorette and uh, we, Dancing with the watch Stars. Those. Thanks for covering for me. Yeah, you're um, welcome. <laughs> so, <laughs> this is a project that keeps me busy, it keeps me focused. I know. And the most, the one thing, number one, is the cost of them. Wait, wait, wait. They're not, expensive. We're not but, there yet. But I know, but that's just kind of ties into number two. And <laughs> this is awkward. <laughs> so You're awkward. Are we, are we discussing number two or number one both right now? Both of them. They're, I mean, they're right, both I'll, the same I'll address thing. number two. Okay. This is, you know, it's a good hobby. I'm not going to play poker or okay. something like that away from you. I'm, okay. I'm uh, uh, kind of building a, a small little empire here and, you know, Fake friends and fake friends. That's great. Virtual fake friends, except for you. You're you're one of my real friends. Who knows? I may be able to sell the YouTube channel for like five hundred bucks someday. That's awesome. And all and, and half of that will go right in your pocket. Cool. Because YouTube will the taxes will get the other half. You are welcome. Oh, thank you. Okay, so now let's talk about number one. I'm not surprised. This okay. was number one. Yeah. But you got to remember. This is an investment. Mm -hmm. So this is the same thing as uh, putting it in a bank, but it's more but secure. But it's not. So let me... So what happens if one breaks? Well, that would never happen. <laughs> That's a good thing. <laughs> one broke this morning. I was uh, shipping something off to Gem Mint, actually, and it broke. It's an investment. Mm -hmm. It's not investment. It's a hobby. I know. I, what happens if you know you buy one for five hundred dollars and then a year later you, you can only sell it for two hundred? That would never happen either. Then we're out three hundred bucks plus well, the shipping. Well, that means I enjoyed it and that three hundred dollars. It's kind of like going to a movie. Yeah. After you go to a movie in the theater, you don't have anything. I still have a statue at least to show for it that I could get some some cash back. Not if you sold it for for negative money. You know what? Let's talk about your <laughs> hobbies, lady. <laughs> I don't have any. So I think you collect some things, yes? Yeah, just on a s small, small scale. I think that if you collected statues, you would you would feel much different. Probably. Well, it's a good thing you say that because I bought you a statue. No, you didn't. Yes, I did, and it's right here. So, you guys will get to see her real reaction and open this up in another video. Well, this video was kind of awkward, but we do appreciate you watching. And uh, someone's gonna look forward to sleeping on the couch tonight. I'm just kidding, we have an extra bed. <laughs> it's true. Which we've never had to use. I know. I know. Isn't that nice? Yeah. Yeah.
That's because our bed is amazing. Amazing. <laughs> it really is. Even if we're mad at each other. I know. He can stay on his own side. That's true. You, you, uh, I get like uh, 80% of the bed. 90. 90. And then you get 10%. <laughs> but uh, hey, go ahead and comment below what your significant other, if you have one, or uh, maybe your friends, hate about statue collecting. See if any of the reasons line up with Mrs. X. And I ask you to do that because it'll help you win this upcoming statue giveaway. To win one of these Mortal Kombat statues, all you have to do is comment on a video. At 15,000 subscribers, I'm going to pick a random video and pick a random comment. That person will win the prize. They can choose between these two pieces. Also, make sure you're subscribed to the channel. So thanks for tuning in, guys. we got a lot more plans both with and without Mrs. X on the channel right now without because... Uh, yeah. So uh, please hit that Mr. X logo to subscribe and see future videos with and without Mrs. X or check out some of these other playlists of stuff we've done. Talk to you tomorrow. Take care.